Hi, good morning all. Hope you all are fine. Um, so in last class, we were discussing about chapter 8, creating tables in MS Word, right? So we already created the tables in MS Word. Now again, we'll have a review on that. So this is uh, an exercise similar you can see in the textbook also like I have added a tables with names um, elephant lion tiger and I have added picture on it okay so you can see the first row is a single one I have merged it and then the second row divided into three columns number name and picture okay and I have added the data so I'll show you how to create this table again okay for that you will open MS Word you will create you will take a new page like this okay from the new you will take the blank document okay now we got a blank document <coughs> so here from insert tab this is the insert tab you can see this just look on the mouse pointer this is the insert tab click on the insert tab we can see the tables the first option itself click on tables okay so these all are the different ways we can create the tables fine so i will choose the first one first method using grid okay so just like moving my mouse pointer i can choose the rows and columns just think in your mind how many rows and columns you need okay see the picture you can with the help of textbook you can check the pictures okay see i need one two three four five rows similarly three columns so i will check that and I will from here I will choose one two three three columns and five rows just count and check it just click on it and here I can increase the size accordingly according to my need okay so in the picture it's the first row is merged that means merging the cell merging the cell means to bring the cells together see these all these squares we call it as cell okay these all are the rows how many rows we have one two three four five rows and one two three three columns okay the vertical part are called columns and the horizontal part the horizontal lines intersecting lines are called rows so here in order to merge the cell i will select the cell right click see here you can see merge cell here we can see delete cell merge cell if you want to set the border style everything is available just on right click here i will merge the cell then i will write it as um, increasing the size for your comfortability I will make it as bold and I will write here wild animals key okay. and I want to make it as a heading so I will select it I will make the alignment here center so it will be looking good if I want anything else from here I can do it like capitalize or if I want I want uppercase I will change it to uppercase we already discussed in the last chapters if I want to change the colors I can do that okay all those things are available here we already discussed in the last chapters you all know that I know it now so here it's very small huh? so I will make it here number one two three okay and here name this is how we will enter 
datas in excel okay first i will choose elephant then lion tiger okay this is how we are entering datas in tables okay now i want to insert picture also in my table see how to insert picture in a table from insert tab here i have an insert tab from here only we added the table from the same tab i will add pictures see from insert click on pictures when we click on pictures it will show us the dialog box like this that means the location we have to choose the location where our pictures are okay if it is in the desktop you can select it from the desktop if it is in another folder like d folder or uh, you have if it's in the download uh, downloads then you can choose that so my pictures are in the desktop from the desktop i have to choose it uh, elephant is here okay then insert select the picture click on insert uh, the picture came okay so you can resize it accordingly like this see you can resize to make it small or big whatever using the mouse pointer you can do that again you have to click on the place where you want to insert the picture if you want to insert the picture in the next tab you will click here if line should be if, if it is in the second row it will be here so just click on it and uh, insert the picture same procedure inserting picture i'll choose lion like this insert okay as i told you we can rearrange the sizes like this okay so we'll get the table like this clear in the textbook i think more uh, columns are there like elephant and elephant babies then picture one more column is there so check the textbook exercise and you can practice this okay you know how to open the word right i will show you again from the start button you will choose either you can search the word here or you will choose it directly okay so this is how merging also it's important how to merge it select it right click merge here we have already merged so it is not showing now in order to insert a new column then just right click see insert insert column to the left column to the right column row above row below everything is there if i want to insert again column to the right see this is how i will insert a column key and again we have another topic split cell just click on the split cell that means we are going to splitting dividing the cell okay this is how we will split the cell see i splitted the cell that means a single cell i have divided sorry that means a single cell i have divided into three okay this is the difference between merging means we are putting together splitting we are dividing the single cell into different okay thank you please check the exercise in the textbook and do practice take care